To one goal, one team, one value in motion. Everyone has a story. We are the heroes of our tales, driven forward, compelled to thrive. At NBSU, we learn, we grow. What moves you? Get active today. Join the MVSU National Alumni Association, 5000 by 2025. Text MVSU alum to 72727 or visit us online at mvsunaa.org. 5000 active alumni by 2025. What is motion? Motion, a change in place or position. Progress, forward or onward movement. Innovation, the action or process of innovation. Evolution, gradual development. Growth, developing physically, mentally, or spiritually. Breakthrough, an instance of achieving success. Join the V-Club today and support the Delta Devils. Be the catalyst for change. That's MVSUVClub.com. The discipline. The high standards. The lessons. Both on and off the court. As student athletes, we strive to win in more ways than one. Despite the trials. We persevere. We stand. Dedicated to one goal, one team, one value in motion. Everyone has a story. We are the heroes of our tales. <laughs>
Ask MVSU alum to 72727. All right, Gerard, slowly move to where the kickoff's going to be. Gerard, slowly move. Slowly move to where the kickoff's going to be. Good evening, everyone. This is Derek Fears. I'm the voice for the Mississippi Valley State University Delta Devils live stream game today. Uh, this is the Delta Classic, and they will be Mississippi Valley versus Delta State, uh, a Delta rival. Yeah. This game has been played now uh, right at six times. This is the sixth time that this game has been played. With, with, with Mississippi Valley winning, going one and four right now. The last time they played was uh, in 2013. This rivalry began back in September of 2000. So, uh, it, like I said again, it's a Delta, Delta rivalry. Beautiful day for football here at Rice Totten Stadium. And it'll be in Mississippi. We're getting ready for the kickoff. Mississippi Valley is receiving to start the game. The kick is away. And there will be no return. give you the starting lineup for your Delta Devils here shortly, uh, but they're lined up, ready to go. Goodwin is looking to pass, but he, he tucks it and runs to the sideline. Short gain. Second down, but there's a uh, Delta Statesman down on the field on the first play. Just real quickly and briefly giving you the starting lineups for your uh, Mississippi Valley State University Delta Devils. Starting at quarterback today, you have number two, TJ Goodwin. Your running back and all SWAC first team, Caleb Johnson. At wide receiver, number 17, Cameron Gardner. Uh, the other wide receiver, Ja'Cory Rankin and Donald Johnson. And our fourth slot receiver is uh, D'Angelo Wagner. Starting at tight end, Sylvester Campbell. Left tackle, Jalen Jones. Left guard, Rio Clayton. At center, if I'm correct, that's Rodney Luckett. I want to make sure. And right tackle, James Lofton. Second down, second and long for the Delta Devils. Goodwin's pass is incomplete. We're looking at third down now. Third and long for the Devils. Mississippi Valley is wearing this traditional Green on green with its red and white stripes down the leg and on the sleeves. Delta State is in its dark gray bottoms with white tops. Good one back to pass. Has a little time. Uh, incomplete just off the fingertips of number 14. That was Donald Johnson with the incompletion. That's fourth down. And Mississippi Valley is out for the punt. Good one, pass incomplete. It'll be fourth down. And seven. The punter is number 16, Orlando Fernandez. He's a junior here at Mississippi Valley.
No fair catch. Short game for the Statesman. Number 82 on the reception. Number 81, Cameron Hines on the stop. That was Cameron Hines with the stop for the Delta Devils. Delta State will start at the 40-yard line with good field position. Mississippi Valley starts out defensively. Stopping the run with a, with a loss on the play. It's no gain. That was number 50. That was Ronnie Thompson on the stop for the Delta Devils. Second and long, short pass. He's got a little room. Tripped up by number seven. That's Kenneth Martin with the shoestring tackle for the Devils. Saving a long gain. So that makes it third down third and maybe four for the statesman Mississippi Valley trying to get a little pressure it look the ball was stripped the ball was loose who has it They are short of the first down. Delta State recovered. They're still on the field. Well, now they're coming off. Yep. It's fourth and one. And the kicking team, the punting team comes out for Delta State. That's number 19 for the Delta Devils with the fair catch. That was Trey Luckett. I'm trying to get these names right, right here. That's Trey Luckett with the uh, with the return, which there was no return. So again. Mississippi Delta, excuse me, Mississippi Valley State University starting deep in its first and 10 on the nine yard line. Uh, there are some flags on the field. Okay. That's against Mississippi Valley State University. That will back them up even closer to the goal line. So they're deep in their territory. That makes it first and 15. Can't really make too many mistakes down here. Uh, you don't want to put yourself in a bad situation uh, with the defense. They can kind of put a little pressure on you and kind of put you in a bad situation. So we got to make sure that we, we do a good job of protecting the quarterback and giving them a little time to throw the ball and possibly, you know, open up a hole or two for our running back, our our, our all swack first team running back to, to kind of get going today for us. Again, this is a beautiful opportunity for two great institutions to get together and play a great game. Delta State and Mississippi Valley State University. That was Caleb Johnson with the run, short game. Caleb coming to you out of Memphis, Tennessee. Caleb maybe gained maybe two yards up the middle, so it's second down and maybe 13 for Mississippi Valley. Now, 
Oh, the snap is high. Ah, and it's out of the end zone. So that'll end up being a safety. Safety. For Delta State, again, that's what I was kind of mentioning there. You know, you, when you you put yourself in a bad situation with the penalties, you kind of man, it's it just anything can happen with, with young people this day and time. So those mistakes are prevalent, and 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 we made one high snap, and we gave Delta State two points there on, on just a simple mistake. That's Coach Vincent Dancy there. That's your head coach here at, at Mississippi Valley. Doing a great job turning the program around, getting the guys going all in a positive direction. Really excited about him and his tenure here. Uh, everything is going to keep going forward. Orlando Fernandez is back to drop punt for Mississippi Valley State University. They normally do this after a safety. Uh, again, a good kick. Returned starting at about the 30 yard line, but Delta State takes it out to about the 47-yard line with, with great field position for their second possession of the ball game. That's first and 10 for Delta State. is incomplete I think but yeah it skipped off the ground second to ten quarterback for Delta State is that Patrick Shigod he hands it off short gain across the 50 yard line across midfield into Mississippi Valley State Territory. That's Kevin Smith, the running back for Delta State with the last couple of carries there. We got third down. Third and maybe seven for the Statesman. And we do have some markers, penalty markers on the field. Look like our referees and umpires are going to have a lot of work today. They've just started the ball game off, and they, they're throwing a lot of penalty flags already. Yep. That will bring up third down, third and 11. That makes it uh, third and long for the statesman. So God is out, drop back to pass, and he, he tucks it and runs. Gets away from one, but couldn't break the second tackle. Kenneth Martin on this and that was Kenneth Martin, Mr. Martin, again with the stop four. The Delta Devils. Martin seems to be the man today. He's everywhere around the ball. Yeah. 
That's Kobe Bates back returning punts for the Delta Devils. Again, he, he did a fair catch, so we should have fairly decent field position this go round. So let's uh, see how it goes. Just outside of the 10-yard line. We're going to start on the 13-yard line here, first and 10. And once again, deep in Mississippi Valley State territory. Now we got Jelani Eason now in at quarterback. So it looks like we're going to alternate a little bit with our quarterbacks. You know, TJ Goodwin was in first. Now Eason is in. That was a short handoff and run for Valley State. Second down. This might be the smart thing. To, oh, my goodness. A fumble. But what's the ruling on the field? They're ruling them down. Uh, we, we caught a break there. Uh, that's a first down run for Mississippi Valley. Uh, seemed like we were about to put ourselves in another situation there with a, with a fumble, but, but the runner was down. Knee was down. Easton is on the run, and he has to get rid of it fast. One of the things that we did notice that, that just kind of going from game to game, that our offensive line does have tendencies to break down pretty fast. So if they give Easton and Goodwin some time to throw the ball, then and you know we possibly have an opportunity to kind of move the ball. But right now that is kind of showing from the last couple of ball games that we really don't have a lot of time to make decisions in the pocket. So we have to kind of get rid of it fast. Eason back to pass. Just overthrows his receiver. Pass incomplete. That makes it third down. Third and 10 for Valley State. Has D'Angelo Wagner there, one of our receivers that's having a pretty good year this year. He's a senior. I'll tell you a little bit more about Wagner. And he's in back to pass. Pocket collapses quick. And he's on the run again. He's sacked. With a loss. That's fourth down. The punt team is in again to kick it for Valley State University. Fourth down. Short kick, short kick. Short kick. It looked like it almost touched someone out there. We just can't figure out who it was, but uh, Delta State will take the ball, take over in Mississippi Valley State field. First and 10 on the 47 yard line. Statesman with the run and a good gain. Second and five for the statesman. Short pass is complete for a first down. 
a host of Delta Devils with the stop. But again, Delta State is in the Mississippi Valley State side of the ball, side of the field, excuse me. In Delta Devil territory. There's pressure on the quarterback. He missed him. He's got room to run. That's number six, Cedric Moffitt with the touchdown saving tackle. It's now first and 10 on the 20 yard line. Again, Delta State is kind of keeping everything moving fast to keep our defensive people off balance. They're back at the line pretty quick and, and lining up very fast and, and, and putting the pressure on the defensive team, trying to wear them out a little bit. I think one of the, that's the strategy there to kind of keep us off balance. But that was a second down run that possibly netted six yards. Second down and maybe four. Shagad is back to pass. It, it looks like a holding, but he throws it away. Shagad pass incomplete, but wait a minute. There is a close mark. Shagad, Patrick Shagad back to pass incomplete, but again, that was holding on the statesman that a mech. That'll march him back a few yards. Give our defense a little time to rest here. So it's second down. Second and maybe 13. That passes to Gainwell. He's got a little room. Oh my goodness. Oh my goodness. That He's a big tackle. It looked like it shook up Gainwell a little bit there. Yeah, Corey Gainwell looked a little shook up on the play. Yeah. They have taken him out of the ball game. It is third down. Third and maybe six yards for the statesman. In the backfield now, you got Christian Molly. She got back to pass. He jumped passes. Interception by the Delta Devils. That's number 28 for your Delta Devils with the interception, the big time interception that we need. That's Caleb Alexander with the big time defensive play that we needed to stop the momentum of the Delta Statesman. That's a big defensive stop there for So there was a penalty as well. And again, that was against us, Mississippi Valley. And it pushes us further back into our end zone area. So that puts us at first and 10 on the 10 yard line. So again, we really need to be careful down here. Not to make any mistakes. That was a high snap, but he was able to receive it. Short gain. A host of statesmen on the stop. Second down. Thomas on the carry. Looks like it's going to be a little ground and pound today for us. Second down. Second and seven. Second down. 
for Mississippi Valley. Easton with the handoff again. That's Jacoby Thomas doing all the work right now. Short game for Jacoby. Third down. Third and four for the Delta Devils. Third and three. Third and three. Third and three. Jelani Easton at quarterback making the calls. Look like they're getting ready to change it. They reset. Easton starts again. Looking down the middle, step up. He's got pressure, he's got to run. Tackle by the statesman just short of the first down. It's fourth down. The punting team comes on the field again. Four minutes and five seconds remaining in the first quarter. Mississippi Valley is, is having some ups and downs right now offensively. The defense is, oh my goodness. There's a f marker on the, on the field as well. The football hit the Mississippi Valley State defensive player. And uh, Delta Statesman was trying to call a uh, fair catch. Let's see what's going on out there. That penalty is against Mississippi Valley State University. Again, that put Delta State into Mississippi Valley State territory. Delta State has had great field position this entire first quarter, and our defense is doing a wonderful job just only allowing two points, and that was an offensive mishap. So we need our defense to continue to hold the statesman out of the end zone. Chagat's pass From the Delta Devil, too far ahead of its receiver, so it's second down, second and ten for the statesman. That's a big stop there. That's big number 50, Ronnie Thomas with the stop. But, but let's see what's going on. There's another marker again. Like I told you, the referees and umpires are pretty busy today. Eh? Thomas on the stop for Mississippi Valley, but wait a minute, there is a mark. Personal foul. Defense. All right. Don't know who that uh, personal foul was against, but it was a changer there. We just had a big time stop and sack and a loss on the play. Now, 15 yards added on for Delta State. So that's first and 10 at the 20 yard line. Chagod with the handoff. Patient run by, an, oh, the ball is on the field, but again, it rolls out of bounds and it stays into possession of Delta State. That was a big stick by your Mississippi Valley State University defensive club, but we could not get the possession. We got Christian Mallory on the 
carry for Delta State. Short gain stopped by a host of Delta Devils just to keep keep them just short of the first down. That's third and maybe two. Third and two for the Statesmen. Short pass, swing pass to the to the sideline. First down reception, catch and run for Delta State. Tyler Kennedy for Delta State with the reception and the first down run. Again, Delta State jumps up there to the, gets on the line fast and tries to keep everything. Ball was deflected, oh, and the quarterback catches his own deflection. Pass to yourself. I guess that how that, that's when it's going to be labeled here. Uh, pass to himself. That's second down. Fox on this down from Mississippi Valley. It'll be second and goal. Second and goal for Delta State. Pump fake, pass, incomplete. That's a good break up there for Cedric Moffitt. He's doing a really good job there defensively for us today with the, with the pass breakup for us. Third and goal. Third and goal. Chagod keeps it, quarterback sneak, gets some of the yardage back just inside of the five yard line. It looks like to maybe the four. So that's fourth and goal. Let's see what Delta State is going to do. The kick is up and good. That makes the score now. Delta State five. Mississippi Valley State zero. Again, it's a beautiful day in the Delta for the Delta Classic. The sun is starting to go down a little bit, so hopefully it's starting to cool down a little bit out there while while the fans kind of get settled in, the, in, in their seats and enjoy this, this game. Again, like I said, this is our sixth meeting. This is our sixth meeting and first since uh, 2013. So excited about this opportunity to start this game up again. Yeah. For any fans that are out there just listening, our next game is against Jackson State, but that's actually on the road. Yep. Our next game is September 24th at Jackson State at 2 p.m. Get a chance to go out there and see Dion. The kick is away and into the end zone. That's a touchback. Forty-seven seconds left in the first quarter. We have a baseball score, <laughs> it looks like, you know, right now. So our defenses are really playing solid here. Uh, again, Delta State 5, Mississippi Valley State 0. Coming out at the quarterback position. Again, we have number one. That's Jelani Eason. Quick pass. 
Delta State snuffed it out fast. That pass was complete for a loss. Maybe two, loss of two, so that's second and. Second down, second yeah. and 12. And 12, second and long for the Delta Devils. That's the end of the first quarter here at Rice Totten Stadium in the beautiful campus of Mississippi Valley State University. At MVSUNAA.org, 5,000 active alumni by 2025. What is motion? Motion, a change in place or position. Progress, forward or onward movement. Innovation, the action or process of innovation. Evolution, gradual development. Growth, developing physically, mentally, or spiritually. Breakthrough, an instance of achieving success. Join the V-Club today and support the Delta Devils. Be the catalyst for change. That's MVSUVClub.com. The discipline. The high standards. The lessons. Both on and off the court. As student athletes, we strive to win in more ways than one. Despite the trials. We persevere. We stand. Dedicated to one goal, one team, one value in motion. Again, we're back. Changing ends. Jelani with the handoff. That's Johnson with the carry. Tough running for. The Delta Devils. Delta Devils back up on the line, ready to go. First and 10, just across the 35 yard line, marked the ball at the base, 37. Jelani back to pass, across the middle, Deflected, uh, incomplete. Second down, second and 10 for the Delta Devils. Jelani is taking his call from the coach to see what, what, what's getting ready to Jelani back to pass. He hands it off to Johnson, has it up the middle. Short gain. Four yards for the Delta Devils. Jelani back to pass, short pass. Looks like he got the first down and a little more. That's number 12 with the carry for the Delta Devils. That's Driver, the tight end with the reception. First down. First and 10. 
the ball on the 45 yard line of the Delta State Territory. Pass, Jelani back to pass, uh, just overshot his receiver. He had him for just a second there. That was to Corey Rankin, just short of catching that one. But sometimes you have to kind of stretch that defense out to kind of open up your running lane. So hopefully that will help Caleb Johnson with the with the run game now that they know that we will take a few deep shots here and try to make sure y'all guys are playing as honest. Third, second down, excuse me, second and 10 for Mississippi Valley State University. Handoff, again, just as I said, but Delta State right there at the line of scrimmage to make it a tough one gain, one yard gain. Third down, third and long. Johnson with a gain of two, third and eight. High snap, pressure on the quarterback, but he gets it off. Ah, and a great open field tackle by the statesman to just force fourth down. We are, we are going for it. Fourth and three, maybe. Fourth and three. Eason at the quarterback position with Johnson in the backfield with him. High snap again. Quick handoff. Johnson manhandled him for the first down. That's your first team all swag running back right there saying, put the team on my back, and I'll get this first down for you because we need to keep this momentum going. First and 10, Mississippi Valley. That was a gutsy call by coach there. He, he, he needed that one to work for you. Oh, oh, no, no. Bad snap. And we lose the ball. Delta State recovers the turnover. Jelani Eason was just a little too anxious to get moving and uh, left without the football. And sometimes that happens again. The, un the most unusual thing about all of this is, you know, this is one of our things that we actually do well. We really do not turn the ball over a lot. And today that was just a big turnover in a, in a, in a bad position. And that's twice we've done that today. That's a first down reception by the statesman just across midfield into Delta Devils territory. Again, quick pass by the statesman to keep our defense on their heels. Reception complete, second down, second and five. Again, Delta State is up on the line of scrimmage and ready to go. That's a handoff to number 24. Up the middle, short gain. That was Afonso Franklin for the statesman with the run. Third down, third and short, third and maybe one yard for the statesman. Delta State in the I formation, but again, that's a penalty marker on the field, and it goes against Delta State. False start.
That backs him up five, makes it third and six. Quarterback is scrambling. He has a receiver wide open. Reception. And tackled by for Mississippi Valley. That was number six, Cedric Moffitt, the second again on the stop. He's being very busy today. But that's a first down reception for the Statesman. She got again with the handoff. No gain. That's a stop at the line of scrimmage by the Delta Devils. Second down, second and second and nine for the Statesman. Lewis on the stop for Mississippi Valley. Second down, second and nine. Scott has a little time. And that pass is incomplete out of the end zone. Third down. Third down by the Statesman. We got pass incomplete. It will bring up third down. Third and nine from the 25. That's a quarterback keeper up the middle. He had a little room to run. Looks like another <clears throat> first down for the Statesman. Right now, Delta State is keeping Mississippi Valley defensive team on the field and constantly moving. That's the handoff. He's running wide, tripped up by number 28. That's Caleb Anderson for the Delta Devils with the stop. Second down, second and six, short pass. First down, reception, first and goal for the Statesman. Seven minutes, seven minutes left in the second quarter and the Statesmen are knocking on the door that pass is incomplete. Second and go. So God's pad sails over the receiver's head just out of the end zone. So it's second down for the statesman. Alfonso Franklin is in the backfield. Chagard fakes the handoff, keeps it, and he scores the touchdown. Touchdown, Delta State. Delta State did a really good job of keeping Mississippi Valley State off balance offensively by, you know, just speeding the game up and getting up there on the line real fast and, you know, just, just getting your defensive players, you know, out of whack and not, not giving them a chance to get set. And so it, it showed toward the end of this drive where they Everyone has a story. We are the heroes of our tales. Driven forward. Compelled to thrive. 
At NBSU, we learn, we grow. What moves you? Delta State kicks off. A little scribbler down the middle, picked up by number 14 with some running room and some blockers. Just across the 50, still on his feet. Into statesman territory. That's a big momentum changing play that we needed to go into halftime. We got about six minutes and 37 seconds before half. So that's a big play for your Mississippi Valley State University Delta Devils. It'll be first and 10 in Mississippi Valley. All of that statement 39. That's Donald Johnson, the third, returning that for us. Just out into statesman territory. We got a quarterback change, but a handoff to Caleb Johnson, red shirt junior, 5'9", out of Memphis, Tennessee. Played his high school football at Memphis Academy of Health and Science. Again, Johnson is a first team, preseason first team all SWAC selection. He's going to be our, our workhorse today. Eh? Give the ball to Johnson again. No gain on that possession. Third down. Third and seven. Johnson is 46th among all active NC2A players in career carries per game. And you can, you can tell just looking at him, look at that. He is a workhorse. Look at that body. I mean, he is a prototypical running back. 46th again amongst all active NC2A players in carries. Third down. Back to pass. He short pass. Oh, just incomplete. In and out of the receiver's hand. It's a really good job of Jamari Jones, who's now in at quarterback, keeping the play alive. And he scrambled, and I actually had something going, and we just lost it. Demonte Hamilton. Holloman lost it. Delta the Devils back to punt. Delta the Devils did a really good job of getting under the punt to down it inside the five at the four yard line. First and 10 statesmen at their own four yard line.
Shagad starts in his own end zone. Oh, my goodness. And the pass is caught at the 30-yard line and taken out to about the 35-yard line. Make that the 33-yard line, first and 10 for the Statesman. Short pass again. That's a great stop by the Delta Devils. That's number six. That's your Cedric Moffitt one more time with the stop. Delta State with the carry just over the 40-yard line. Third down, ball sitting on the 41-yard line. Third down, third and two. Third and two for the Statesman. Short game, turn it into a long game. That was Kevin Smith. It looked like he was met at the line of scrimmage, and all of a sudden he burst out of the line of scrimmage for a big game for the Statesman. He takes the ball into Mississippi Valley State territory, first and 10. There's a Delta Devil on the field. That's number 50 there. Yes, Ronnie Thomas. Yeah, he's up and and jogging to the sideline, so he looks like he's going to be okay. Three minutes, 18 seconds left in the first half. The score: Delta State 12, Mississippi Valley zero ball just across the 35 yard line and Delta State is running it trying to keep the ball away from Mississippi Valley State that's a second down first down run but a second down second and eight now for the Statesman Pass across the middle and caught by the Statesman. Dante Myers with the reception just across the middle, draped. And again, they're moving it fast to try to keep Mississippi Valley off balance, but we deflected it. Ball batted down. Ball batted down by number 59 for the Delta Devils. That's Chris Victor for your Delta Devils with the deflection, making the pass incomplete. Nowhere to go for number five, Kevin Smith, tackled by a host of Delta Devils. That makes it third down, third and long still. She got back to pass. Nowhere to go. He, he tucks it and runs. Gets to the sideline close to the first down marker let's see where they mark him fourth down, fourth down. Oh, 
It's fourth down. So field goal team is on the field. Snap is low. Kick is low. But it's good. Delta State adds three more to the score, making it 15 to zero right now. 15, Mississippi Valley. Back with a minute and 26 seconds left in the quarter before halftime. The kicks away. Looks like we're going to return it. Got a little running room. Just across the 35 yard line. It's number 19. Kobe Bates returning it for the Delta Devils. Delta Statesman is draped all over our receiver and no, no penalty markers, nowhere. Pass incomplete. Again, Jamari Jones is in at quarterback for your Delta Devils. That's number eight, wearing number eight. And he's looking to get something going for the Devils before the half. Throws an incompletion, nearly intercepted by the statesman. Makes it third down, third and 10 for the Devils. We're in a four receiver set, looking to get the ball down the field again. Quarterback's running. First down, is it? Or just short of the first down marker? Jamari Jones looks pretty good scrambling with the football. If the offensive line can give him just a little bit more time, he, he actually does a good job throwing the ball down the field. Maybe we can get a few receptions going and get everything moving in the second half. Jones again surveying the field. Rush is coming. Pocket collapse. He's running again. Just short of the first down marker. The ball goes over on downs back to Delta State. Delta State with 48 seconds left in the half. 
takes the ball at the Delta Devils. 30, no, that's the 44-yard line. First and 10. Short gain by Delta State. They stopped the clock with a timeout. Timeout on the field. Delta State. Get active today. Join the MVSU National Alumni Association, 5,000 by 2025. Text MVSU alum to 72727 or visit us online at mvsunaa.org. 5,000 active alumni by 2025. What is motion? Motion, a change in place or position. Progress, forward or onward movement. Innovation, the action or process of innovation. Evolution, gradual development. Growth, developing physically, mentally, or spiritually. Breakthrough, an instance of achieving success. We're back. It's second down, second and eight. Delta State back to pass. It's complete. The receiver's still on his feet, fighting and fighting. Join the Gets to the 30-yard line, maybe. Timeout again on the field. Statesman. Okay, we got a little action going on. We think the runner was down before uh, he gained the extra yards. So the judge, referees and line judges are discussing it right now. Support the Delta Devils. Be the catalyst for change. That's MVSUVclub.com. The discipline, the high standards, the lessons, both on and off the court. As student athletes, we strive to win in more ways than one. Despite the trials, we persevere. We stand dedicated to one goal, one team, one value in motion. Everyone has a story. We are the heroes of our tales. Driven forward. Compelled to thrive. At MBSU, we learn. We grow. What moves you?
We're back. Delta stays back to pass. That's pressure. Just gets it off. It's complete to the 10 yard line. Out of bounds at the nine yard line. First and go. First and go to go. For the statesman. Shagat's back to pass. Got a little time. Floats it. Incomplete. Second down. Ten seconds left. Before halftime. Delta State's back to pass. Again, out of bounds. Incomplete. Four seconds left. Defense is doing a really good job of, of making it tough for them to receive it. today join the MVSU National Alumni Association 5000 by 2025 text MVSU alum to 72727 or visit us online at mvsunaa.org 5000 active alumni by 2025 what is motion Motion, a change in place or position. Progress, forward or onward movement. Innovation. Let's make some noise! You want me to just go midfield? We drank it in that game. We drank it in that game. They're facing the yeah.
that for me. My right. My left or right?
Scott Fitzgerald, Associate Director, Mrs. Boogie Moore, Sand Dahl Director, Mr. Gerald Smith Jr., Devil Angels Flags Director, Mr. Dana Devil, Percussion Coordinator, and Mrs. Stefan Mathis and Mr. Sand Evolution, gradual development. Growth, developing physically, mentally, or spiritually. Breakthrough, an instance of achieving success. Join the V-Club today and support the Delta Devils. Be the catalyst for change. That's mvsuvclub.com. The discipline, the high standards, the lessons, both on and off the court. As student athletes, we strive to win in more ways than one. Despite the trials, we persevere. We stand dedicated to one goal, one team, one value in motion. Everyone has a story. We are the heroes of our tales. Driven forward. Compelled to thrive. At MBSU, we learn. We grow. What moves you? Get active today. Join the MVSU National Alumni Association, 5,000 by 2025. Text MVSU alum to 72727 or visit us online at mvsunaa.org. 5,000 active alumni by 2025. What is motion? Motion, a change in place or position. Progress, forward or onward movement. Innovation, the action or process of innovation. Evolution, gradual development. Growth, developing physically, mentally, or spiritually. Breakthrough, an instance of achieving success. Join the V-Club today and support the Delta Devils. Be the catalyst for change. That's mvsuvclub.com. The discipline, the high standards, the lessons, both on and off the court. As student athletes, we strive to win in more ways than one. Despite the trials, we persevere. We stand. Dedicated to one goal, one team, one value in motion. Everyone has a story. We are the heroes of our tales. Driven forward, compelled to thrive. 
At NBSU, we learn, we grow. What moves you? Get active today. Join the MVSU National Alumni Association, 5000 by 2025. Text MVSU alum to 72727 or visit us online at mvsunaa.org. 5000 active alumni by 2025. What is motion? Motion, a change in place or position. Progress, forward or onward movement. Innovation, the action or process of innovation. Evolution, gradual development. Growth, developing physically, mentally, or spiritually. Breakthrough, an instance of achieving success. Join the V-Club today and support the Delta Devils. Be the catalyst for change. That's MVSUVClub.com. The discipline. The high standards. The lessons. Both on and off the court. As student athletes, we strive to win in more ways than one. Despite the trials. We persevere. We stand. Dedicated to one goal, one team, one value in motion. Everyone has a story. We are the heroes of our tales, driven forward, compelled to thrive. At NBSU, we learn, we grow. What moves you?
Get active today. Join the MVSU National Alumni Association, 5000 by 2025. Text MVSU alum to 72727 or visit us online at mvsunaa.org. 5000 active alumni by 2025. What is motion? Motion, a change in place or position. Progress, forward or onward movement. Innovation, the action or process of innovation. Evolution, gradual development. Growth, developing physically, mentally, or spiritually. Breakthrough, an instance of achieving success. Join the V-Club today and support the Delta Devils. Be the catalyst for change. That's MVSUVClub.com. The discipline. The high standards. The lessons. Both on and off the court. As student athletes, we strive to win in more ways than one. Despite the trials. We persevere. We stand. Dedicated to one goal, one team, one value in motion. Everyone has a story. We are the heroes of our tales, driven forward, compelled to thrive. At MBSU, we learn, we grow. What moves you? And we're back. And Delta State will start off the second half with the football, but there's a marker on the field to start the second half off. That penalty will go against Delta State. To start uh, half off. That backs them up, and they will start deep in their territory in the third quarter. It'll be first and 10 from the 10-yard line. She got stops, starts in the backfield with number five at the running back with a short gain. That's Kevin Smith on the carry. Gain about maybe four, second down. That time, that was a very good job of the Delta Devils with the stopping the run. But it looks like there's an injured devil on the field.
Looks like that's number 99, if I'm correct. Jalen Bell for the Delta Devils. He's up. Yes, sir, that was 99. Jalen Bell out of Detroit, Michigan. Maybe got his bill wrong a little bit there. Glad to see him able to get off the field on his own. Delta State will have the ball third down, third and maybe four for the Statesman. Again, Shigad and Smith are in the backfield. Player goes in motion. Shigad keeps it. But a good job by big number 90 for your Delta Devils. That's Dedrick Jones with the stop. Dedrick Jones and number 55 also was in on the play. They did a really good job. That's Jalen Jones of, of sniffing it out, not to let that quarterback get any extra yards. Let's see who comes out at quarterback for the Delta Devils. It looks like number one, and that's Eason, who will lead us <clears throat> to start the second half. Jelani Eason leads the Delta Devils out in the second half. Got four receivers. High snap again, but we're going to just hand it off to our bruising running back, and he's going to get us a big first down. That's Johnson with the run and the maybe 11 yards. Jelani back to pass. Incomplete, just missed his receiver. Second down. The ball rests at the 50 yard line. Second and 10, again, is a handoff to Johnson. Upended at the 39-yard line. Another good run by Johnson. I'm surprised he didn't get up and say, feed me, feed me. Like old Zeke Elliott over at the uh, Dallas Cowboys. Just say, feed me, feed me. <laughs> One more time, they give it to him. Oh, quarterback keeper. And he's still on his feet. Ah, out of bounds. Just shy of the 20 yard line. Again, Delta State defense went for that. Trying to load up and stop Johnson. And the quarterback still had it and, and got us a first down. First and 10. Johnson was met in the backfield by the statesman. No gain. Maybe a loss of one. Second down and 11. Jelani back to pass. Quick pass. Pass is complete for another first down for the Devils. This is something that we possibly need to keep doing, you know.
get the ball out the quarterback's hands fast, give the receivers a little time to run, hand it to our all swag running back, and keep going. Move it, move it. Delta State's in the backfield with the sack, stopping Eason with the carry. Second down. That makes it second and long for the Delta Devils. Delaney back to pass, a back shoulder pass, complete to number 11. Great catch by the Delta Devils. That was Rashad Eads with the reception, a great catch. Delaney led him with the back shoulder pass. Makes it a more Manageable third down possession, third and seven for the Delta Devils. As Jones in at quarterback, decides to keep it, really nowhere to go. Stopped by a gang of statesmen. Fourth down, just trying to make sure. Field goal team comes in. It's an opportunity to score tonight. Kick is up and good. That's Orlando. Fernandez to get the uh, Delta Devils on the scoreboard just out of halftime. That's a big drive for the Delta Devils. Get active today. Join the MVSU National Alumni Association, 5,000 by 2025. Text MVSU alum to 72727 or visit us online at mvsunaa.org. 5,000 active alumni by 2025. And we're back. Receiving for the Statesman. They take it at the goal line, bring it out. That's number 22 for the Statesman. He brings it out just across the 40 yard line. Gainwell on the return. <coughs> Coach Dancy with a little concern. And again, a quick pass by Shagard just to get it out of his hands and let the receivers go to work. It's a first down reception. Delta State again on the line fast. Shagad has it. He hands it off. Short gain. A 
That's number 30 with the stop for the Delta Devils. It's Lewis, our starting linebacker. Pass is deflected. Chagard caught it again, but a great job with number 59 of tackling that elusive quarterback for a loss. That's Chris Victor with a great stop. That makes it third, third and long for the Statesman. Again, Mississippi Valley showed pressure, got out of it. But Delta State throws a strike. And I mean a strike right down the left sideline to a streaking number 83. And it just drops right in his hands for a touchdown. Winthrop, the wide receiver, just literally the ball dropped in his hands and he just continues to run into the end zone. The extra point is up and good. That makes the score Delta State 24, Mississippi Valley 3. When this game began, we were one of the most, well, the least penalized teams uh, over the first two ball games. But today, the penalties really hurt us and kind of put us in some bad situations early and kind of dictated how the game is kind of going now. Uh, so again, that penalty goes against the Delta Devils. That allows Delta State to kick the ball off at the 50-yard line, if I'm correct. Yes, the 50-yard line. And Delta State just kicks it completely off the field. <laughs> so there's no return. Offense comes back on the field, led by number eight. That's Jamari Jones. Out of East Mississippi Community College and Northwest Rankin High School. Jones is a junior for the Delta Devils. He keeps it. He's got a little room to run. Just across the 35 to the 37 yard line. Jones waits for the calls from the sideline. 
Now the Devils are ready. First and 10 at the 37 yard line. Devils on attack. They keep it on the ground to Johnson. Short gain. Second down. Here is the number three, Caleb Johnson. Gain to four, second and six. Jones again with the completion just across the 50 yard line. That's Rankin with the with the reception. First down. First down. Jones is running. Short game. Second down. Second and maybe eight for the Delta Devils. Jones throws a quick slant. The receiver gains maybe four to five yards to make third down a, a manageable down. Third and maybe two. Third down. Jones pass complete. Third down. Third down and two. He keeps it. Quarterback sneak. No gain. The offense is still on the field. Look like they're trying to make a decision whether they would like to go for it on fourth down. It's, it's short, fourth and maybe two yards. And they are going for it. Jones back in the backfield with Johnson. He gives it to Johnson. Johnson has a big hole straight up the middle, spins, breaks one more tackle for a first down run. That offensive line did a great job opening up a hole for Johnson to run through. Now again, Delta Devils back on the line. Gets it to Johnson one more time, but he is met in the backfield by a statesman. Big number 54 was there before he even received a handoff. That's Demetrius Swirly on the tackle. Second down. Jones back to pass. Has a little time, short pass, complete to Johnson. He hits one. Johnson is getting his money's worth tonight. He is, is, is working hard for the Delta Devils. That makes it third down and maybe four yards for the Delta Devils. Jones back to pass. Again, a short pass to the tight end. He's tripped up by number 38. That's a first down reception for the Delta Devils. We have a handoff jammed up at the line, short gain. That was number 39, Jacoby Thomas on the run. Short gain 
of two, second down, but we have a timeout on the field. What is motion? Motion, a change in place or position. Progress, forward or onward movement. Innovation, the action or process of innovation. Evolution, gradual development. Growth, developing physically, mentally, or spiritually. Breakthrough, an instance of achieving success. Join the V-Club today and support the Delta Devils. Be the catalyst for change. That's MVSUVClub.com. Mississippi Valley back on offense. Jones back to pass. Again, a quick pass. God, just short of the receiver. Incomplete. That makes it third down. So Corey just, just couldn't reel it in. We're in a four receiver set with Jones back and Johnson in the backfield. Now, quick pass just over the middle. Big reception by number four, Ja'Cory Rankin making up for that reception before. That's a first down for the Delta Devils. First and goal. Johnson still on his feet, fighting and fighting and fighting. No call. Is it a call? Is it a touchdown call? Yeah, touchdown. Touchdown. Caleb Johnson did all the work on that run. He had to make sure that he was going to get us in the end zone that time. Fernandez kick is up and good. Up and good. With 121 left in the third quarter, Mississippi Valley makes the score 10, Delta State 25. The discipline, the high standards, the lessons, both on and off the court. As student athletes, we strive to win in more ways than one. Despite the trials, we persevere. We stand dedicated to one goal, one team, one value in motion. Everyone has a story. We are the heroes of our tales. Driven forward. Compelled to thrive. At NBSU, we learn. We grow. What moves you? All right, we're back. Kicking off in the end zone. Now that was a well-deserved or well-needed drive by the Delta Devils that allowed our defensive unit to, to get a little rest. So now they can get out here and, and, and get us a stop or two. And if that happens, it gives us a chance to get back into the football game.
a missed tackle that allowed this runner to get to the outside and, and gain a first down. It looked like they had him bottled up at first and he spinned out of the tackle and ended up getting a first down on the right hand side of the line. Quick pass by Shigad. Big stick, but the receiver stays on his feet and gets just across the 50 yard line. Let's see where the referees mark the ball. It's second down. Yes, the ball is marked on the 50. There's pressure on the ball. Ah. That's a loss on the play by the statesman. So it makes it third, third and 10. That was a break that the defensive unit needed to slow the statesman's momentum. That will end the third quarter. Totten Stadium on the campus of Mississippi Valley State University and you were just listening to the Mean Green Marching Machine she got back to pass a little pressure but he's able to complete it tackled from behind by number 52 of the Delta Devils. That's Dion Reed. She got back. Back to pass, quick pass. The pass is caught, but number 32 was on top of the receiver as soon as he caught it. That's Frederick McGee with the tackle. That makes it second down, second and six for the Statesman. Again, a quick pass, incomplete. That makes it third down, third and maybe six. For the Statesman, this would be a good time for a defensive stop for your Devils to get the ball back and see if we can make it a Two possession game. Quarterback run. Met at the line of scrimmage, but fell forward for maybe three or four more yards. It looked like there's a statesman down. Number 65. Thank you. 
The wear and tear of the game now is starting to take hold of uh, several of these uh, linemen, offensively and defensively. Yeah. I hope he's okay. He's still down. Looks as if he's going to be okay. They, they're helping him off the field. All right, let's see where the ball is being marked at. Looks like it's a fourth down, but it's very close. Coach Dancy is, is surveying the statesman offensive set here. It's fourth down. Look like they're going for it. Quarterback sneak. The ball's out, but again, the linesman calls him down. The line judge calls, calls him down. There's a discussion on the field. That's a big stop for your Delta Devils. Well deserved, well needed. So they take over offensively on downs. And Jones comes back out on offense as our quarterback. Okay. We now have a Official review of this last possession. Get active today. Join the MVSU National Alumni Association, 5,000 by 2025. Text MVSU alum to 72727 or visit us online at mvsunaa.org. 5,000 active alumni by 2025. Welcome back. And once again, the, the review on the field stands. And it, and Mississippi Valley keeps the football. It's first and 10 for us just across the 30-yard line. Again, Jones is in charge. He drops back the pass. Has a little time. Scrambling. Oh, there's a marker again in the backfield. Jones on the keeper, but wait a minute. That penalty goes against uh, 
to Delta Devils. It bags us up 10 yards, makes it first and long. Jones has four receivers out wide, three to the left, and he goes to that side, has a man down the middle, and a strike to number 14 with the big reception for the Delta Devils. That was Donald Johnson with the reception for Mississippi Valley. And the statesman, 42. First and 10 now with the ball marked at the 42 yard line. Jones again with the quick pass. Number 83 with a run after the catch, gaining another three to four yards for the Delta Devils. That's Miles Hobson with the reception and the run. There's a statesman down, so there's a timeout on the field. What is motion? Motion, a change in place or position. Progress, forward or onward movement. Innovation, the action or process of innovation. Evolution, gradual development. Growth, developing physically, mentally, or spiritually. Breakthrough, an instance of achieving success. Join the V-Club today and support the Delta Devils. Be the catalyst for change. That's mvsuvclub.com. We're back, and uh, Mississippi Valley has a lot of momentum going their way in the third. Jones on the run, just across the 35 yards. The that makes it second down and three. Jones, quarterback keeper, pick up eight. Second down, second and two. Jones back, quick pass. Delta State is on top of this play for a loss. That makes it third down. Mississippi back on the line. Three receivers to the left again. The pocket collapsed. Jones has room to run. He keeps it across the 20. That's enough for a first down for the Delta Devils. Jones has been that little spark plug that the Delta Devils needed in the second half. He's the third quarterback that, that, that's come in tonight, and he's done an excellent job off the bench, prepared and ready to play. Short pass, complete, and out of bounds. Ja'Cory Rankin with the reception, but a short gain. Second down, second and maybe eight. Clock is running with about 9.50 left in the ball game. Jones again back to pass. Pocket collapse. Jones short dump in the middle. Rankin. Rankin 
catches the pass just in front of the goal line. First and goal for the Delta Devils. Again, Jones has done an excellent job of being a spark plug for the Delta Devils in the second half to get some movement. And he has moved and marched the team up and down the field the entire second half. Second and goal for the Delta Devils. The high standards, the lessons, both on and off the court. As student athletes, we strive to win in more ways than one. Despite the trials, we persevere. We stand dedicated to one goal, one team, one value in motion. Everyone has a story. We are the heroes of our tales. Driven forward. Compelled to thrive. At NBSU. Jones with the pass. It's a touchdown to the big tight end. Number 85 for Mississippi Valley. That's number 85, Sylvester Campbell with the reception and the touchdown. The kick is up and good. And that now puts us at a two score ball game. With 9 01. Okay, we're gonna call it a, a one score ball game. I'm 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 the old school guy. <laughs> Still kick the field goal. <laughs> we grow. What moves you? Ready to kick off. Again. The kick is short. And Delta State brings it out just across the 35 yard line. A host of Delta Devils met the runner and they are all fired up now it's a ball game i do believe there is a marker on the field the umpire and the referees are trying to figure out what's going on and they will let us know just shortly. First foul, face mask, number 22, kicking team. A 15-yard field will be enforced in the end of the run, first down. 
That penalty is uh, against the Delta Devils. That gives Delta State very good field position to start to drive off. Delta State has three receivers to the left. And she got us back, he hands it off up the middle. Number 24 for Delta State on the carry. That's Afonso Franklin with a first down run. Again, up the middle. With Franklin on the carry. A gain of maybe six, second down. There's a penalty flag. It's against Delta State. That will bag them up. A, a needed penalty to help out our defense. She got it back. He's back to pass. He has pressure, scrambles out of the pressure, throws it out of bounds, throws it away. Very good pressure there. That came from number seven. That was Kenneth Martin with the pressure that caused Shigad to uh, rush his pass. It's third down, third and nine for the Statesman. Coach Dancy is firing up the sideline, getting them. It's a run. Number 24 still on his feet for first down. Seven fifteen still remains in the ball game. First and 10 for the Statesman on the 25 yard line. No gain. Number 24 stopped at the line of scrimmage. Second down, second and 10. Delta State is taking their time now. As you notice earlier, they were up to the line and, and stopping really fast, but now they're trying to use this clock. They, they're trying to run this, this time out. There was a movement again in the line. That bags up Delta State again. Another five yards. And that's second down, so it'll be second and long for the Statesman. Chagas back to pass. Quick pass, completes to number 84. To the 15 yard line. Short run. Yeah. 
It's fourth down. Fourth and one. The kicking team is on the field, attempting the field goal. That kick is up and good. It remains a two score ball game. For the Delta Devils. Get active today. Join the MVSU National Alumni Association, 5,000 by 2025. Text MVSU. We're back. Delta State kicking off and out of the end zone. So Mississippi Valley will start with 5-10 left in the ball game. On the 25-yard line. Again, 5-10 left in the ball game. I think the Delta Devils have maybe two timeouts to work with to try to break this two possession game. Pass incomplete. Second down, second and 10. Jones is getting the next play from Coach Dancy. They're set and ready to rock and roll. He has four receivers wide. Has a little time, no time. The ball is out. Recovered by the Delta Devils. Jones was sacked and ball knocked loose. That makes it third down, third and long for the Delta Devils. He's open. He's got a little running room. Colt from behind. First down reception for the Devils. That was a big time reception there and needed play to keep the drive alive for the Delta Devils. Jones back to pass. He has, gets a little pressure. He decides to throw it out wide. Gives Johnson a little time to run. He gets out of bounds with a short gain. Three minutes 
40 seconds left in the ball game. The ball rests on the short pass complete to number 15 for the Delta Devils. That's D'Angelo Wagner. And that gives us a first down in the Statesman territory. Again, Joan is back to pass. As there's a little pressure. He gets away, has time to pass it. Ah, and just misses his receiver. That makes his second down for the Delta Devils. Jones keeps it, slides. That's third down, third and maybe well, there's a timeout on the field. Seventy-seven, or visit us online at mvsunaa.org. Five thousand active alumni by two thousand and twenty-five. What is motion? Motion, a change in place or position. Progress, forward or onward movement. Innovation, the action or process of innovation. Evolution, gradual development. Growth, developing physically, mentally, or spiritually. Breakthrough, an instance of achieving success. We're back, and Jones back to pass. Throws a quick slant that is deflected at the line. That makes it fourth down. Coach Dancy would like to talk it over with the offense to make sure that everybody's on the same page here. It is fourth down, fourth and four for the Delta Devils. Offense is back on the field and ready to go. They're actually going to kick the field goal. It's up. And no good. Delta State takes over with no timeouts for Mississippi Delta. 
excuse me, Mississippi Valley State Delta Devils. Two thirty-nine left in the ball game. Battle of the Deltas. Correction. Mississippi Valley did have one timeout left and just used it to stop the clock. 2.31 left in the ball game. Join the V Club today and support the Delta Devils. Be the catalyst for change. That's in the SUVclub.com. The discipline, the high standards, the lessons, both on and off the court. As student athletes, we strive to win in more ways than one. Despite the trials, we persevere. We stand dedicated to one goal, one team. We're back. And again, no gain for the statesman. But no timeouts to stop the clock. Everyone has a story. We are the heroes of our tales. Driven forward. Compelled to thrive. At NBSU, we learn. We grow. What moves you? They keep it on the ground. Shagad with the carry and the slide. It's fourth down. Mississippi Valley State University next home ball game will be here October the 8th versus Alcorn State University at 6 p.m. Come out and support the Delta Devils again October the 8th versus Alcorn State University 6 p.m here in the uh, Rice Totten Stadium. That's Delta State's final timeout. Again, the score is uh, Delta State 28, Mississippi Valley State 17.
48 seconds. And the Delta Devils will take over at the 33 yard line with no timeouts left. But I've seen a lot happen in, in, in a short period of time in football. So let's see what we can do here in a short period of time. See if we can matriculate down the field and try to get a quick touchdown. Jones comes out. Surveys the field. Four receivers wide. But doesn't have time to throw it, but he dumps it to Johnson for quick first down and out of bounds with 40 seconds remaining. The ball is on the 45 yard line. Jones back. Again, pocket collapse. Again, a quick dump to Johnson and again out of bounds. First down. Thirty-three seconds left. Again, pressure. Jones has a little time to throw. Has to get it out of his hands. Pass incomplete. Second and 10 for the Delta Devils. Quick slant, but again, the statesmen are all over it. Third down. Five seconds left. That's the ball game. Remember, once again, the next home ball.